Hello, folks, and welcome back to Golden Crone Hotel. We're going to go ahead and jump in here. I believe the Alchemist is the one. Yep, all potions identified immediately. Um, the problem is the primer trying to be potions, but we don't necessarily, I don't think we have to choose something. So let's go ahead and do the Alchemist here. Okay, ice first thing. Um, we're also a vampire first thing, which means, should we be taking damage on the ice? Ow. Okay, don't. Be careful here. Okay. That's easy enough to do that. Uh, right, we can't actually read anything just yet because we are a vampire. Right, so we need to be human first. So you guys are now currently my friends. I guess the goblin is not my friend. Let's just pick up all the books we possibly can. The nice thing about the alchemist is that all potions are identified. Which means we instantly know what we have. So right now we start with a lizard leg and a silence potion. Silence could be okay. Silence could actually help us with the baths. I would like a soul elixir. Uh, just so we can become human for a while, but that might not happen until the next floor, which I'm actually okay with. But now we know there's a bunch of vampires down here, so we'll deal with that when the time comes. Hello there, vampire hunter. Today was not your lucky day. I'm going to take all the lore we could possibly get. More bullets. Not that we really can use a gun right now. Wow, still poisoned. I don't think vampires should be able to get poisoned. It would change a lot of the mechanics of the game, that is true, but, like, as a vampire, do you even have, like, a circulatory system? I mean, I guess, I don't know, you're undead, so maybe not, but I don't know exactly how that was supposed to work. Hiding from the sunlight right now. Oh, right, you're not actually a bad guy yet. Okay, big old expansive nothingness, that's new. The wolves apparently also don't like us. Used to be in vampire lore that um, vampires could change into anything. Like it was a matter of, it was more like, it was more like fighting a wizard. You know, like a, a really powerful wizard who knows a lot of like poly polymorph self spells. They ter transform into like a bat or, um, don't, don't do that, or a wolf or something like that. Like they, they could do a whole bunch of cool stuff. In the modern lore, it's kind of more limited. Come over here, buddy. Oh, he's not going to walk through the sunlight. Though he might get hit anyway. Come on, go ahead and get hit. Oh, no, he just keeps on running away from it. Okay. All right, so I think that's it. I really would like... Oh, no, we don't. We do know. We do have a way to turn human. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that now. I was going to wait... Let's go ahead and do that now. Soul Elixir. Huzzah, we're human. Okay, so I would like to... Oh, we do have to transmute. Okay, I will transmute the Lizard Leg. I will transmute the Glow Potion. Uh, okay, you know what? Learning how to glow, I'm okay with that. Let's do that. Levitations you get, I'll take that. Umbra. Tempting, but I think we're just going to get the mana. Tempting to get the Umbra, though. Okay, so there should be a bunch of vampires over this way. True story. Uh, let's see. There should be another vampire over here. If we look at the minimap, they're, like, right over this way. There's a green guy. Who the hell's the green guy? Oh, no, he's the merchant. Okay, we need to go downstairs, I think, for more vampires. Because I need all the experience I can possibly get. Hey, guys. Holy crap, you guys just kind of surrounded me, huh? Let me go back upstairs. That was not great. I'll take the decks up. Rest up a little bit. There we go. Back downstairs. We're you and we're good. Wow, they just all converged on me. That was rude. I totally chose the wrong staircase. Oh, speaking of wrong staircases, there's like five guys here. Nope. Just nope right out of that. Let's go over here. That's potentially better. Um, maybe not. Crap. Crap on a stick. Uh, this is where we die. 
Yep, I can't. I can't. I can't. Nope. I should have chosen a farther away. Okay, quick restart on the Alchemist. I should have chosen a farther away. Oh, we start with a key. Staircase. That's the word I want there. My brain was looking for it. It was like, I know I can I know the word. I know the word. I didn't know the word. It was staircase. Okay, back up over here. We need to keep these guys. Oh, that's right. I start off as a vampire. Don't need to worry about fighting vampires until later. Freaking bats. We got a bunch of guys down here to fight. But see, this staircase right here, prime. This staircase over here, totally prime. Unlikely to come at me all at once that way. Another key? I mean, I guess don't mind if I do. Would you guys just freaking die? Thank you. Of course, keys are useless without the actual appropriate chest, but we'll see. Oh, don't you even start, buddy. Alright. Snake, of course, poisoned me. I need to learn cleanse. Not that it would help me as a vampire, but overall, in general, not a bad idea. We do have a soul elixir already, which is great. Oh, damn freaking sunlight. At the wrong time. So I'm just going to go upstairs really quick. And then go back downstairs. Uh, I need blood. I need to drink lots and lots of blood. Another key. Okay, I leveled up because the monster stepped in the sunlight. I'm okay with that. Let's get the decks up. Okay, good. So, midday actually puts us in the shadow. I'm okay with that. Go there. I need blood. Like, too sweet. Um, do not have enough cash. Cannot afford. Oh, I guess we go upstairs? It's dangerous. I'm going to do it anyway. Okay, there's plenty of walls around, so that's fine. Take a new gun, sure. There we go. Blood donation. Oh! I never used a potion. True story. True story. I probably could use a soul elixir and then just rest it. That probably would have been better. That probably would have been better. Let's try that again. Man, going through three episodes, three lives rather, in less than 10 minutes is a little embarrassing. Okay. Start off as a vampire. Would you stop it, you freaking bat? Honestly, don't know why you'd want a lizard leg potion. Like, the lizard leg, I mean, I guess you get the regeneration, but it's pretty slow. It's never actually used it. I suppose we could use it and see what happens. Okay, so we know what those are. Fantastic. Uh, just come down here, finish this off. Yeah, not having to identify potions is actually, like, it's easy mode. It's really nice. Okay, well, we don't have any keys now, so now, of course, is the time the game's probably gonna give us lots of chests. I'm not bitter, I'm just saying that, you know, Murphy's Law is totally a thing. Um, I don't need that, but I'll take it anyway. Okay. Hello there, bees. I definitely, okay. Definitely need to just, uh, get more dexterity. Come over here. Lead the wolf over. That was closer than it needed to be. Okay, give me more decks so I can actually, like, do shit. Alright. We do have a soul lecture. I want to take out this hunter first. It's morning. So the midday sun is going to be coming through this side. Like another, what, ten turns? Pretty soon, anyway. You're just a regular old goblin. Not an anarchist. That's alright. You're a rat. And you're gone. Get all the books we can, and that looks like it. Okay, so the midday sun should be going on that side. Yep, sure enough. Oh, don't go that way. Go around this way. I'm gonna stay a vampire for a little while longer. Not too much longer. Oh, yep, you just got vaporized. Alright, so it's evening, so now the sun's going through here. That was actually way more than 10 turns. That was like 20. Uh, do I have a way out? I have purple. Yeah, purple's on the way out. And it's like down from here. Walk right into that. Uh, wait for the shield to make itself clear. And then it'll be nighttime. 
pretty soon. There we go. Okay. Wait for it. Would you... Can I... <laughs> Could you just freaking hit these guys, please? Okay. Resting's not going to help me. I need a soul elixir. I need to be human. And then we can... Sure, we'll learn... Uh, we'll transmute the potion of bounty, because I'm never going to use it. Transmute the teleport potion. I will not learn any of those. Oh, I did. I learned enrage, which is not what I wanted to do. I want to hit D. My brain did D. That means B, right? No. No, it doesn't. Oh, crap. I don't have time to heal up, so... Oh, 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 so we're at the, uh, <laughs> we're at the halfway point. This is run number 50 right here, right here, run number 50 out of 100. This is a fun game. I'm having fun with it. I may sound frustrated once in a while. That's part of the fun. One of the great things about roguelikes is that every time you die, you can totally see why it happened. Like, it's not because of some bullshit mechanic. It's just because shit happens. And sometimes you can control that shit, and sometimes you can't. Sometimes that shit is just out of your way. Just nothing you can do. Ancient plate leggings. Well, at least we got some cash for it, but still. Okay, get some... Okay, sure. Oh, I did that in the wrong order. I should have gone around to get the copper plate first, and the golden breastplate would have been sold. This way, just replaced it, and you don't sell it that way. I mean, not that you need the extra, like, five bucks or whatever, but still. Just die. Thank you. Get my decks up, because I'll need that. Drink some blood. And get the potion. Okay, that's a soul elixir. Or no, that was actually blood we just picked up. I think they're sorted alphabetically right now. I'm gonna drink the experience. Get our strength up. There you go. Okay, just gotta be careful. A lot of sunlight around here. And more bullets I'll totally take. Way upstairs, I don't need yet. Hang on, I'm gonna go take the soul extra before we even need it. Maybe that was my mistake before, is just not doing that early. I will transmute the lizard leg. And I will transmute one of the blood potions. Okay, that actually means a health potion. That's actually good. I will take shock. Okay. Murder you. Thank you. Rest up a little bit. And I don't need to fear going into the sunlight anymore. Unfortunately, I can't kill the hunter, but that's all right. Thank you for walking into the sunlight for me. Ooh, sword. Excuse me, I want that sword. Okay, it's a golden sword, but still. Better than what I had. And sure enough, I walk right in the sunlight. This is why I like being human, is because I don't have to worry about it. Being vampire is kind of... It's okay. I think it needs maybe a little more benefit to it, aside from the added strength. I suppose not letting you cast spells or shoot things is enough of a detriment. Alright. Well, I feel more clever. Great. So, we got an intelligence boost from that. That's fantastic. Okay, Banshee. I want to make sure you're going to come over to me here. Yeah, I'm going to come down this way and push you up against the wall. Fantastic. No more dexterous. Don't mind if I do. Ow, fr okay, let's test out that dexterity. There you go, right to the face. Nice. Nice when it works. Okay, we can kill some zoo animals. I'm not adverse to that. Oh, he just jumped ahead, didn't he? Can I get ahead of this guy at all? Answer there is no. Rest up a little bit. Oh, there are wolves. I guess just one wolf, but still. Uh, as a vampire, we're probably more able to take out, say, an elephant or a polar bear. As a human, that's probably going to be a little difficult. 
Maybe, but I don't know. How about we just wait? Like, we don't need to go down there immediately. We'll just wait. There's no, uh, there's no special ring or anything we get for dealing with the Majorai, so we'll just, uh, we'll just hold on. We can always come back. Well, unless we die. But don't die. Pro tip. Pro tip, death can be ameliorated by living. Probably not actually how that works. Actually, we know how that is not how that works. We're walking into the sunlight there. Appreciate that greatly. Uh, I will not levitate. Hasn't come up yet, but every once in a while you do get those nice pieces of loot just out in the middle of an island somewhere. And it'd be nice to be able to pick those up. Um, Ward is tempting. Yeah, let's go ahead and do Ward. I do need the mana up at some point, but... Oh, cleanse is good, too. Let's get cleanse. There we go. There's our set. Ooh, entrance to the grotto. Do I want to go to the grotto? Give me cleanse here. Rather not take four or twelve turns of poison, thank you very much. He just walked right into that sun. Oh, but then he drank my blood. That's just rude. Okay, frog there. You died. That was actually easier than I thought it was going to be. Mm, don't need to level up Levitate. If there's a level up for Shock, I would take it. But I think all these other ones are fine. Well, leveling up Ward wouldn't be bad either. But let's just take the mana. I'm looking down at my keyboard now to make sure I'm hitting the right key. Not going to trust my brain anymore. Thinking B is D is just ridiculous. There's no reason for that. Oh, we have a werewolf. Come over here, bud. Come on. Oh, one shot to that mercenary werewolf. No worries. Uh, I don't know if I want... We can wait for the grotto. Let's not go there yet. Let's go up as far as we can here, and we'll worry about other stuff later. We have a lot of holy water. We have some soul abilities. Okay, stronger than you look. There we go. We're out. Rest up a little bit. Oh, and no resting for me, because this guy's right here. And then a B. Let's test out our dexterity. Nice. Okay, great. Our dex is great. Run some lights around here so we can actually see. And... Okay, so heal is nice, but... No, I think I'm just going to go ahead and take the max mana. Okay, big old golem. No worries, he's one of the weaker types. Now, if he was a sapphire golem, or no, a ruby golem, that's what it is. Ruby golems are the tough ones, aren't they? Okay, wolf, no big deal. Let's come right up here. Bop you, no worries. Another wolf. Also no worries. Entrance to the gallery would be nice. This is the Baz. Oh, I, do I have a clarity? Acceleration potion is not going to cut it. Do not, well, silence might. They can't sing to me. I can't be tempted by their song. Silence might do it. That was an ale. Uh, won't last as long as I would like, though. So I think we'll hold out for a clarity potion just to be on the safe side. I do want to go to the bath, though. There's something I want to do. I will transmute the... Let's go combustion potion, because that one's pretty dangerous. Okay, turn to an antidote, which we already had. Kind of would be a clarity, but whatever. Okay, keep on heading up. Um, Nope, take the mana. We are famished, by the way. I should probably eat something. Uh, have an ale. There you go. I have never done that in real life. Like, it's never been, oh, I'm hungry. Let me drink something. Uh, no, I guess I... Okay, so I haven't done it with alcohol. I have done it with, say, you know... Um, a smoothie or something like that, you know? Like, I'll go to, like, Jamba. This is dangerous. Get some strength up. Uh, go to, like, Jamba. And that's basically my meal for the day. Wow, these stuns are just out of control. Oh, there's a Maori over here. Shoot him. 
Okay, just punch him in the face then. There we go. Another Maori. Uh, before you shoot, because I'm still vulnerable. Let me get rid of the vulnerability. There you go. And walk over to him and punch him until he dies. There we go. Much as I would love to shoot these guys, let's just hold off. Get rid of the vulnerability. There we go. And shock. Oh, right. These guys are kind of not vulnerable to it. You kind of have to level up the shock before you can actually kill them with it. Forgot about that. Okay, we're not a vampire yet, but we're pretty close. Just light up all the torches. I'm a, yeah, I'm about to become a vampire. Uh, that is the way to the rafters. I don't want to fight gargoyles. We can do like the first level of the rafters. I'm not sure about the second. We've never successfully fought the gargoyles before. There's probably a technique to it I'm just not aware of. But they just surround you with a whole bunch of, like, gargoyles. There's probably, like, maybe you go downstairs a lot. Like, just keep on going up and down stairs, up and down, up and down, until the gargoyles are gone. I don't think that actually answers how to deal with the boss, though. Oh my god, can you freaking hit anything? I need to up this guy's decks. Okay, here we are as a vampire. Now let's go ahead and take out some of these hunters. Yep, you shocked me. Good job. You're dead. Down here. Take... Oh, okay. Good shot. Okay, we gotta be careful of the morning sun. Mm, we've got another couple of vampire hunters north of here. So let's try to go around. Yeah, there we go. No, don't get surrounded by these guys, though. There we go. There. Nice. Okay. Yeah, it seems like I keep on finding excuses not to go to the places that they keep on offering me here. Hopefully there's a gallery, though I guess there's not always. We just stick to the regular floors. Uh, let's up my decks a little bit. We stick to the regular floors. We can have our pick of which one we want to take on. Let's go upstairs. I know it's dangerous because it's midday, but it's fine. Alright, I can't destroy you because we're both vampires. So your vulnerability is not going to be my best day here. So that's the way the, gal the gallery. Okay, first of all, let's level up. I get more strength up. I don't think we want to be an officer in the gallery. I don't think we want to be human. We don't have any demon blood. Let's hold off a little bit. I do want to go to the library for sure, but the gallery is nothing entirely. Great, took blood. Um, okay, you're just no worries. An evening sun's about to come over from the right or from the left side, so appreciate it if we did go that way until we're ready. Oh, that's just a dead end. I was really thinking there was a door over there. No guarantees, I guess. Okay, so now a new moon, so we should be safe to go over here. Can't pick that up until we're human. What is with all these freaking Maori? Okay, you're out. Drink the blood. Don't shock me. It's very rude. I don't exactly know what that was, but it wasn't shock. I think he tried to shoot me. I think that's what that was. Run the torch, move on. Wolf is no problem. I'm just debating right now, do I want to take on the Gorgon? Kinda? It's gonna be worth it to go down to the library, it just may not be worth it to fight her. Uh, let's, let's go to the next floor. We can always, like I said, we always come back. Not gonna turn human yet, but I'm like on the verge. Especially since it's midday. It's going to be a pain to avoid the sun the entire time. Not impossible, just a pain. Okay, so... Wait a minute, where's my upstairs? Oh, all the upstairs are on the other side where the sun's streaming through right now. Okay, just go and take this soul. Soul lecture. There you go. 
And just get max mana, that's okay. Go get your gold. We'll have some vampires to fight now. Let's do that. They were around here, I could have sworn. Hey, here we go. Over here. Ha. Ah. Over here, there you go. Right in the sunlight, thank you. Okay. Another vampire over here. Nope, don't, don't step into the abyss. Okay, we are decently strong. Not strong enough to take on a Gorgon just yet, but decently strong. Okay, there's a bad guy. Oh, that's right, the Scholar. Yeah, the Scholars are tough. You're gonna see a bunch of those guys in the library and we need to know how to handle them. He's right up here. Yep, there he is. Ooh, that was a tough hit. He critted me right there. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up a little bit. The misses are out of control. Okay, just cleanse the... Oh, actually, we don't need to cleanse the... Bleed. Bleed's gone anyway. Rest up a little bit. Damage. We do have five bowls of curry noodle soup. A lot of bowls. I'm gonna assume they're kept in a thermos or something. Keep them nice and toasty. I just... I can't stomach cold soup. I just... I can't do it. It's just not... It's not palatable to me. It's very dark here. I do not have a glow potion. Oh, no, we do. We totally have glow potions. Okay, more scholars you can shake a stick at. This is going to be very bad. I'm going to run. Oh, it's a bad run. It's a bad run. Okay, so... We do have some health potions. We have two health potions. I'm going to drink an acceleration potion. Just to get me a little bit faster here. The sun's right here, which actually helps a little bit. Man, just die. Oh my fucking god. Okay, get the gold. Yeah, I don't know if I'm strong enough to take these guys out. And you're going to see a lot of scholars in the library, too. And we have a crappy golden shield right now. I mean, that's how bad it is. Cleanse me up. We've got to find a better shield around here somewhere. Actually, what's our character sheet outline right now? So we've got... Yeah, sword, shield, and plate are all terribly outdated. So we need something good for all of those. Okay, there's a way to stop time in case we need it. Some more lore. Some scholars are going to be tough to do when I'm a vampire. I'm actually pretty close to becoming a vampire. Well... There seems to be nothing in any of these places. Oh, hello. Oh my god, can I freaking hit anything? Okay, drink. Or yeah, drink the health potion. Did not actually heal me as much as I wanted it to. Oh, I turned into a vampire. Okay, not what I was expecting, but okay. Uh, resting's not going to help me at all, because as a vampire, that's not how we rest up. Crap, crap, crap. Okay, so grab this and I guess go deal with the scholars? I think we should probably drink the blood first, right? Because otherwise we're going to have some real hard times here. Okay, she's gone. Merchant, I have $510. Can you give me anything? You can give me some blood. Can't afford the animatin plate leggings. Yep, can't afford much in here. So let me take the blood. I guess can't do much for me, but I'll take it. Okay, Lava Golem is not my first choice. Let me go ahead and drink the blood then. There we go. Okay, yep, yeah, that's that's fire. That's what that is. Just keep on missing for some reason. Um, I can't use a gun. Come on, just die. Just, I'm gonna die. That's burning right now. Drink more some more blood. Yeah, the thing is he keeps on healing. Oh my god. Why can't I hurt this guy? Probably not as a vampire. I don't know if this is gonna be much better. Let's go ahead and shock him. He keeps healing. And then I get set on fire. Okay, ward me up. Crap. Crap. The uh the spell fizzed. Okay, drink the health potion. 
I defeated these guys before. It has been done. Finally. Hey, give me that strength up. Rest up a little bit. Okay, there's just lava pools in that corridor now. On the upside, we want to fight the Scholars because now I'm human again. Yeah, come on here. Right through here, guys. It'll be fun. Thank you. Wow, that was dead simple. Just had to taunt them. They're not exactly the brightest bulbs in the, in the list here. Okay, that's it there. This goes... Where does this go? This goes to the Pharmacopoeia. That we can totally do. We can listen to the first level. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully get some kind of good armor. Because right now we are in a bad way. Yeah, let's, let's see what they have. I think I'm a box. Sure. Why not? That's probably not really a snake. Okay, so he's a friend. Good to know. I don't know what you are, but you're dead. The Balur. Not a real Balur, just... An amazing imitation. In the darkness, and probably not a real monkey. And apparently a friend of mine. Uh, right now, a glow spell would actually be pretty handy. I don't know where I'm going. Going this way, I guess. There we go. An actual torch. Okay, so over here, we have nothing, right? Just a way out? Yeah. That just goes nowhere. If I was designing this, that would actually lead, like, to the next floor or something, but this was randomly generated. Thankfully, not actually an anarchist, so we didn't get set on fire. Um, there's got to be a torch around here somewhere. Come on, give me a torch. I guess I could just shock. There we go. There's a torch there. Okay, that's the second level. Do you not want to go there yet? With our current weapon and armor set this layout, it would not be good. Not be good at all. There's another way over here. Come on, give me some light. Okay, no torches whatsoever. Just using the occasional shock as a way just to tell. Okay, light this up. That's fine. Oh, you're totally... I don't know what that is. It's like it glitched out there. Oh. oh. Okay. I don't know what that was. We need to fight something that was projecting the images, I suppose? I'm very confused over what that was. Okay, you're at... Okay, you're a shadow, but you're clearly like a bat or something. Yeah, you're being a dick right now. Thank you for dying. Okay, we're famished, but we're also about to turn, so I don't know if it's worth it eating food right now. Well, I guess if we get human again, we'll probably want to eat anyway, so I'm sure it's fine. Well, if I turn to a vampire... Actually, we're pretty far away from that. Maybe I don't need to worry about it. Okay, there's another way this way. Thank you for the torch. Not actually a Strigoli, just kind of looks like one. Okay, you look like a Renoki, but you're probably not. A Renoki and a clock, huh? So you're both dead now. Not actually a land shark. And apparently a friend. Okay. Turning into a vampire wouldn't be horrible here. Because then we get more experience. But mm, there was no sign of any, uh, any gear. There's no gear here. Just suppose I should have expected. Okay, let's get out of here then. It was nice getting the experience, but I think we just get out. We can go downstairs later. Okay, there we go. So now we're back out. I uh, didn't actually open this before. Oh, okay. Instantly poison me, why don't you? Okay. Come on, beat up the scholar. Beat him up. I have dex and some strength. Okay, that worked out a lot better than last time, for sure. Crap. Okay, come over here, guys. One at a time. He was strong, but not stronger than me. I'm still bleeding, though. Let's go ahead and cleanse up a little bit. Thank you. 
Hey, Scholar, over here. Come on. He hits hard every once in a while. There we go. Man, rough. Okay, so now we're about to turn into a vampire, whether we want to or not. Um, so maybe we go back down to the pharmacopoeia. Let's actually deal with the hunter first. There. Okay. Back down here, yep, sure enough, these are not my friends now. We expected. That's where we get some more experience. And we cleanse this room, basically. I don't think we want to fight the boss of the Pharmacopoeia as a... It's not with better... Not without better equipment. Hey, not actually a Strigoli, which we kind of assumed. Okay. I think that's it. Yep. The rest of the room's empty. Or rest of the floor is empty. Okay. That makes it evening, which should make it more or less safe to go in here. Yeah, safe-ish. Okay. Uh, so not confused by the pharmacopoeia. That is actually a hydra. They're not going to call it a hydra, but that's totally what it is. Okay. All right. Um, you know what we've never done? Use a summoning potion. Oh, except these guys are going to attack me. Crap. Well... I drink some blood anyway. I drink blood for sure because I'm needed to attack this guy. There we go. We did it. We did it. We have used a summoning potion before. I remember this now. Okay, so these are the staircases up that we cannot use until we collect four magical rings to proceed. Okay. So now we know. Now we know that we are at the top. I'm probably going to go ahead and drink a soul potion so I can do stuff here. Drink that blood. There we go. Uh, the fairy is dangerous, right? Yep. Cast water everywhere. And you're tough. Does the water just stay around forever? Crap. I think it does. So I'm just... Okay, so I have to take damage to move, or I turn to a human again. Which means the other guys are going to come after me, but I think that's just how it goes. Alright. Now I'm human again. Fortunately, these guys should take some damage going over the water. Yeah, come over here, bud. Come on, on the water. Okay, rest up a little bit. There we go, much better. Over here, guys. Walk on the water, why not? What could possibly go wrong? I'm going to go ahead and shock you here. Okay, like, no damage there. Now, standing on the water is not going to help me much. Okay, rest up a little bit. Another one of these guys. Okay, come on. Over here, bud. Okay, he's not going to be dumb enough to cross into the water. If he was a stupid grunt, he probably would, but he's not. Okay, resting up, and we're good. This goes down to the graveyard. Graveyard we could totally do. I'm still worried about the fact that we have, like, base level gear right now. I'm not enthused. Like, we have not seen any gear for a while now. Oh, there we go. So the leggings are not the problem, right? The leggings haven't been the problem in a while. Yeah. The sword, the shield, and the plate are all way behind. Like, the leggings have been totally caught up. Like, we've done that before. Give me some freaking plate. Or a better shield or something. Better sword, definitely. Like, we definitely need that. Because otherwise, we have to go up against these bad guys with base level gear. That's a hunter there. That is not. Okay, you're a little tough. Did it, though. Got a crit on him and everything. Fantastic. I wish you'd healed up before I went over to the Scholar, but sure, let's fight. Let me go ahead and actually drink an ale. And then you get shots. And let's go ahead and ward up. Warding up is the right thing to do. Okay, give me some more strength. Rest up a little bit. There we go. Merchant, you have some stuff here. What do you got? 
Not a whole lot. Can't afford the end of my 10 revolver. It might be worth it to grab some holy water, sure. I'll take some holy water. Um, Maybe a manual? Sure. Okay, I feel more dexterous. I mean, that's great, I guess. Alright, so I guess it's the graveyard. Not a bad first go. The Strigoli is going to be a little tough to take out with base level gear, though. Okay, the demon cannot does not get damaged by sunlight. Come on, just go. Tempted to turn into a vampire for this. Uh, for the graveyard, because that might be making it a little easier. If only because there's not a whole lot of light in the graveyard. We don't have a glow, uh, glow spell either, so that's going to be more difficult. Yeah, we could be a vampire. Um, we can just wait until we can go a vampire. Just wait here. Okay, so we're about to be a vampire. There we go. Go and kill this guy. Oh, he summons golems. I totally forgot that was a thing he does. Oh my god, will you just die? I'm running. We'll deal with that later. Hopefully as a scholar, thing is the only way we're going to be able to deal with it. Hopefully there's weapons here. There's no advanced weapons here. We are bones. No pun intended. Though if you wanted to take that as a pun, that's okay too. Although there's no way to heal here. Uh, not in the graveyard itself, but there is a way to heal in the uh, in the mausoleum. There's usually hunters there. I guess I just turned early. I'm going to wait it. Let's go in the mausoleum now. Yeah, like the spiders. Okay, finally. A mithril shield. Okay, that's something. That's better. There we go. Get that blood. Let's drink all that blood. And it doesn't matter if they try to poison me or not. We're fine. Okay, that's better. Okay with that. Freaking bats everywhere. Go ahead and light the torch. Drink blood. And we're good to go. Yeah, a lot of vampires around here, but also a lot of vampire hunters. Oh, thank goodness. The breastplate. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Now I just need a decent sword. And we'll be able to make our way in the world. Please tell me there's a sword around here somewhere. I'm just thinking, do we want to fight the Strigoli... As a vampire, might be okay. Might be okay. Let's try it. One thing we haven't tried, we probably should, is silence on the Strigoli. Because he likes to summon a whole bunch of undead to fight against me. I wonder if I can actually fight the Strigoli as an undead. I don't know if we've actually done that, have we? Maybe I can't. Well, I'll find out. You gotta be around here somewhere. The thing is, he's a boss man, right? And that usually means that he's going to fight us regardless. Back up a little bit. Let the, let the assassin not come to you. There he is, right there. Okay. Okay, let me think about this. I think we're going to go and cast Silence. All magic in the surrounding area is gone. For 19 turns, which I'm okay with. He still made me vulnerable. Oh, no, I can't fight him. Can't be done. Crap. I'm lighting everything up right now, just because, but... Okay, so we can't fight the Strigoli as an undead, which I guess makes sense. Let's get rid of the Maori. He's gonna be a dick anyway. Um, I'd love to light up those torches, but I really can't kill everything that's not the bad guy here. Okay, so the scholars are going to be tough. Okay, so we have to do this as human. Uh, let's do it then. Let's turn. Okay. 
I want to remove my sight. Oh, that's a good way to deal with the Gorgon, though, so I don't turn to stone. Okay. I don't know how that's exactly going to work, but we can make that work later. Okay, so... Okay, you're going to come over to me. That's fine. The Strogoli I saw briefly there, but... There. Okay, so we're fine. Rest up. Famished. Go ahead and drink some ale. As soon as we see the Strogoli... Oh, okay, the Astrologer's going to see me first. That's okay. Come over here. Over here. Let's beat you up. As long as it's one at a time, I think we'll be okay. Rest up a little bit. We're good. Okay, I definitely need a better sword. Okay, Scholar definitely knows I'm here. There. Okay. I think there's one more Scholar. And it's just a Strigoli. Okay, so silence. He cannot cast magic on me. Can't hear anything either. That's by design. Oh my god. Okay, drink some holy water. I'm full up. He's dead. Huzzah! Okay. Uh, there is one more scholar, but he's trapped behind somewhere. Okay. That would explain why I couldn't see him before. Uh, those leggings are garbage, and I don't want them. Oh, but the adamantine sword. Nice. Okay, that's much better. Okay, so our gear is now on par where it should be. Now I think we can go backwards. Okay, get me the hell out of here. It's dark as all hell and I don't want to be here anymore. Um, oh crap, that wasn't even the way out. It's over here. Down this way. It's destroying mausoleum or uh, tombs as we go. Okay, there's going to be undead here. Um, zap? Let's go ahead and zap. Oh, it kind of worked. Be able to see him long enough for it to work anyway. Okay. Yeah, pull back. And zap. And zap. Not too shabby. And let's get out. Okay, hey, little firefly. There's probably, yeah, just more... Skeleton guys around here, no big deal. Bleeding a little bit, that's okay. Over here, guys. I probably should make sure you only get me one at a time. Okay, we have a chance for a win here. Now that we've actually got, like, decent gear, we've got one ring. It's an indication we could possibly get more. Oh, that's right, this guy. Totally forgot about this guy. Okay, um, big potion maybe? Take him out. There we go. We did it. Huzzah. Stupid freaking lava golems. Okay, so. We need to go downstairs. Downstairs is this way, I believe. Okay, here we go. You're gonna be big for a little while. It's fine. Oh, that's right. There's a whole bunch of lava around here. Uh, let's look at the map here. Okay. The gallery is probably our first good bet. Um, the Baz is tempting. But the problem with the Baz is we don't actually have a clarity potion. We have no way to block the Renoki from actually singing their siren song and drawing me towards them so they can murder me. We have no way to prevent that. And we might be able to get a transmute at some point. But the best chance for that is going to be in the library. And that's going to be past the gallery. Pharmacopia boss isn't going to be too bad, I don't think. I'm trying to remember what he is. I mean, the trouble is we don't know. Um, but I'd rather deal with it once we pass the Gorgon. So I think we'll do that first. Let's go down to floor 7. Um, since I can remember how to actually get down to floor 7. So up here, I think, is the way to do it. Oh, we have some cash. What do, what do you got? Bullets? I have 58 bullets. I have a crazy amount of bullets. I don't need any more bullets. Uh, Grimoire? Maybe we can improve shock, maybe? I don't know. Nope. Just take the mana. You know, we might as well just spend our money. Whatever. Just use a Grimoire, buy it, and get our mana. Buy the Grimoire. And get the mana. Okay, that was pretty much a waste. I would like to have upgraded Shock, but 
Then you're really good chance. Okay, so over here is going to be... Oh, not this way. Other way. Okay. Now we go to the gallery. My guess is we're going to see the lady pretty soon. Okay, we go straight down. Let's look, just go straight down the library. It's just safer. Okay, we're going to see a lot of books down here and apparently a lot of guys to fight. There we go. Level of shock. Thank you. A lot of golem creators. Not a fan of. Stop beating. Oh my god. Okay, drink something good here. Oh my god, they keep on summoning golems. The ice golem I can take care of. It's this freaking fire golem. Holy water to heal me up all the way. And then run away from the freaking lava golem. Okay, there we go. He's out. Don't step on the lava. Wow, chimney cricket. Freaking lava craters. And the trouble is, there's, that's the way back, too. If we knew an ice spell, we might be able to get rid of that. Okay, Ruby Golem's gonna be tough. We can deal with it. Yeah, we've got decent, decent stuff here. Okay, so... Any of these show me an ice spell? I think we trade out one of our spells for ice. I don't know what a spell to trade out, but... We need to be able to get back. This guy just keeps on creating golems because he thinks it's the answer to everything. Okay, nothing there. More golem guys than you shake your stick at. There's a lot of golem guys. That's going to be a pain when we turn into a vampire. And I say win because it is going to happen. Okay, more rubies. At least the ruby golems are doable. Okay, no ice spells there. I mean, we don't need to worry about ice spells. Maybe... Yeah, looks like we can actually wrap around. So actually, maybe that's fine. I will stop with summoning golems, though. What is this dude's problem? It's because he saw me destroy the golem. He's like, no, no, that's my friend. Well, your friend has taken an unexpected vacation, all right? So you'll never see him again. Yeah, we're about to turn into a vampire. Um... Which means the golem guys are going to be real dangerous to deal with, but I don't really... Oh, there's a princess. Okay. Shoot, I would release the princess. There's no way we can deal with that. Okay, so the vampire is about to happen. Over here, I think, it might be a little bit safer. Okay, then we'll just wait to become a vampire. There we go. Yep, come over here. That's why I murder you. You summon a golem. And then you die. Thank goodness it was only an ice golem. If it's a lava golem, it's going to be really freaking dangerous. Oh, freaking glow golem? That's just rude, what that is. Okay, we just got to look out. Okay, there we go. There's a princess over there. We can kill her. It's just going to take some time. There we go. I got us a second ring. Which is great. Okay, come over here. You die. Then we have golem summoners. Um, I don't know what that is. Oh, yeah, that is a back to fire golem. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, there we go. We're actually strong enough. We actually took out the fire, the lava golem first thing. Or magma golem, whatever the hell it is. Okay, we've got a lot of red over here. Yep, that's a scholar. He made me glow. Didn't really do him much good, though. Okay, it's time for that second ring. It's time to go for the gorgon. Oh, that's not the way out. Um, the Gorgon would be... to wrap around, it looks like. Yeah, wrap around this way. Maybe a couple of summoners, but not too bad. These guys know ice spells. Okay. Take these guys one at a time. Not too bad. Okay, totally worked out. Oh, shit! There's an electric golem? I didn't know that was a thing. Okay, get electric golem down. Drink the blood. Drink the blood. Okay, we're good. We're good. Didn't even know electric golem was a freaking thing. Now we know. Okay, time to go to the gallery. Time to deal with this. 
freaking Gorgon Lady. We do have a Blind Potion. I don't know how well that's going to work. It would stop us from being petrified, but... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Then we wouldn't be able to see, you know? So, how well does that work? Don't go standing next to the statues. That's a good way for them to attack you. That's definitely, like, where the boss would show up, usually. So I think that's pretty much inevitable at some point. Ooh, that's some nice armor right there. Might already have something very similar. Okay, good. Okay, you're just a pet, which we can destroy and then drink your blood. Oh, another Gorgon over here. Come on. There. Wasn't so bad. Okay, so the little little baby Gorgons are totally fine. And there's Big Mama. Hey, Big Mama. Okay, it couldn't be much worse. Maybe, maybe be blind. My biggest problem right now, I think, is that she's going to. Uh, she's going to turn us to stone. Yep. Which we can fight against and then drink blood for. She does drop a lot of guys there. There we go. That was actually dead simple. I think it's because of the. Both the armor and the weapons we picked up. Yeah, I don't think we were ready for it before, but I think now we're okay. And I just want to know how we, the heck we get in here. You know, we get the money here or the knowledge here would be really fantastic. There's got to be a way. I'm not as a vampire, though. It looks like there's one more bad guy over here. Oh, the scholar vampire. Okay, which I can't fight. Okay, well, we got three rings, so that's cool. Oh, freaking Gorgon. Okay, come over here. Come on. Come on. There. Yeah, there's some cool swords in here and stuff, but I guess we're just... We're done. Yeah, we go exploring some more, but it doesn't actually matter. All right. So, Pharmacopia is probably our easiest boss to deal with. Uh, where does this go? Staircase up, I think? Yeah. Right, Pharmacopia? We could go to the Baz, but honestly, I don't think that's going to be a good idea. We used up way too many other potions. A blindness potion maybe would be able to help, but I'm not wild about it. I'd rather transmute that if we can. Yeah, it's going to go to the Pharmacopia as a vampire because we'd have. Precious little in the way of soul lectures. Let's go up. Um, the way up is past all that sunlight, though. Be careful. Oh, it's the new moon. Okay, we're fine. Alright, so from here, I believe... Yeah, here's the pharmacopoeia here. Okay. Gotta be a little confused with all the lava around, so I think... I think we didn't explore this entire floor. Stop it. Uh, no, there we go. Pharmacopoeia is down that way. Down over here. Oh, and with scholars. Right, I forgot there's going to be scholars around here. Okay, in the Pharmacopoeia, we've already cleaned this out. So now we just need to go towards the entrance in the second level and hope we don't die. Here's hoping. Cross your fingers, cross your toes, cross your legs, and cross your nose. Here we go. Okay, that was apparently a goblin anarchist. That's okay, though, because we can drink the blood as we burn. More potions, which is actually what we need, which is great. You're probably not really a polar bear. Apparently not, because you freaking had magic. A polar bear with magic is probably one of the more frightening things I can imagine. A wizard polar bear. Yeah, that's pretty scary. That's pretty scary. Isn't there a game about that? Or a movie? Let's say there was a movie about that. They okay, drink the blood. It's freaking bat. There we go. Oh, that was it. That was the guy. There you go. Okay. So we got the fed ring. I think that's all four. We got four. All right. We can explore the rest of the floor, but now we don't. Well, I guess... For more potions, I'll definitely do it. 
Now, the trick is, for the final boss, do we want to be a vampire? Don't remember. The boss himself is a vampire, if I remember correctly. Or at least he was for the scholar fight. I guess we'll just keep the solar... I guess we have five solar... Or soul elixirs. Um, I don't know if it matters. We don't have any demon blood. I'm not sure it matters. Let's go ahead and head on over to where I need to be. So all the way down. Nope, all the way back up. There you go, over here. As we run forward here. Okay, so now... We should be able to go upstairs. Uh, let's go and explore the rest of the floor here. What are you? What the hell are you? Elder Green Man. Never seen you before in my life. We've seen the smaller green guys. Oh, he's not that bad. He's not that bad. Okay. I guess because we have really powerful weapons right now. Like, I probably shouldn't judge it based on that. Okay, great. Back to full health. That was mostly my concern. Got some random potions around, which is apparently a blood potion. Not a horrible idea, especially as we're a vampire. We're about to do the final boss fight. Upstairs. Hello there, golem man. He really loves his golems. Cannot deny. He loves his golems. I'm still on fire. Uh, the ethereal stairs, I think, are over here? Yeah, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. It's funny there's a bunch of gold around. Like, that matters at all at this stage, but I'm going to go and pick it up. That's why the hell not. not. So, uh, hey, Jimmy, dude. I'm going to just go and light these torches for you. There you go. All right. Hey, bud. You want to you wanna talk? Serena, it's been almost 10 years. So sorry for what I did. Didn't understand you. There's plenty of done. Okay, wait. This is the same thing we got before. Yeah, this is the same thing we got for the Scholar. So, interesting, as the Alchemist, we get... The same exact ending. You have to take a solar to see what it's like to be human. Let me see being a vampire. Okay, so you give us a throne. Yep, and then we can basically beat him up. And he doesn't even care. Oh, he'll fight a little bit. He will fight. I can drink the blood. And he needs to smack him. I guess we didn't smack him before. Actually, let me take the soul lecture. Eh, it probably doesn't actually matter. We can probably beat him this way. There you go. And that's it. We spared his life last time, so I figured probably good to go ahead and just take him out this time. There you go. Win as the alchemist. I knew we could do it. it. Just took us some time, but I knew we could do it. Who? It is nice knowing exactly what this, what the potions are. Nice having them immediately identified. That's fantastic. Not something we can regularly depend on, of course, but take what I can get. Yes, the alchemist is fun. Um. We didn't manage to get... I mean, man, we had to struggle for that last bit of gear. Thank goodness we did the... Uh, we did the graveyard first. I think without that, that probably... We probably would have died, like, pretty soon if we had tried to go and finish off, like, the pharmacopia or anything. Because there was no gear anywhere but in the graveyard. I guess in the gallery, too. If we can find out how to actually rob the gallery... That would probably help us a lot. But I have no idea how to do that yet. But there you go. Another win in Golden Crone Hotel. Our second. <laughs> Out of 50 runs. Our second win ever. Not too shabby. Thank you guys for watching. This has been Golden Crone Hotel. I'm Peace of the Universe here at Peace of the Universe 2. And I'll see you guys next time.